Hello, I am Bentham, and this is Avax, Studio and Arumba, and welcome back to Factorio Mesa. Hey. Hello, everyone. Hey. How's it going? Alright, but the power is terrible. It it's, is. Uh... We're still getting power from some steam, but... Alright, let's see. A solar cool. panel averages 40... 42 kilowatts per hour. We have 9,800 of them times 42. So that means we have four, 411 megawatts of power. This is the average that that many solar panels should be able to sustain. And we're using 650 at the moment. <laughs> Part of that is the so accumulator charge, but... Are these steam engines all running as they should? Probably. I don't know. <laughs> I don't worry about things like that. All the boilers are running. The and Some of the engines seem slow to me, though. Because the heat's not, not available. That that whole system was designed to run uh, with the boilers heating water non-stop, but it doesn't play well with accumulators. So, as soon as we added accumulators, that system basically became useless. Oh. We, we should just go back to... Uh, what do you call it? The one fourteen ten layout. So it's the, the I I was confused for a minute, but yeah, it's the the whole column is running but slowly because it can't like build they, up the temperature. I guess would be. Yeah, you can only support ten it, steam engines, and it's trying to support thirty three. But it's is it daytime right now? I can't even tell. I think it is. It looks like it. it so is. shouldn't these be running at full speed? Well, the first one is. The first ten should, and then after that, it should just peter out, because they can't- they don't have enough water. It's all being boiled off. I was wondering if there's a, a way to, like, improve this. Yeah, make I'm more. like, what it makes- <laughs> Just make like, more one- makes this, one- Cut off the later- later columns so that the- first column can run properly or something? Would that help with how water works? Water no, works weirdly. it's still getting the maximum amount of power that one pump can provide. The problem is that the pump can't provide enough water to run those steam engines. So, ten of them run and the other ones just sit there. 24 hours a day. If you want to improve steam power, just make some more 114 tens. Be worth a shot. What's, CJ, what's that ratio again for solar to accumulators? It's like 25 to 21, but I can never remember which direction it goes. Can't remember. Uh, it's I think it's something. more solar than accumulator, isn't it? Yeah. There's biters in the power yeah, arrays again. I have it happen now. Yeah, then we need 8,000... 8,200 accumulators, and we only have 5,600. That's part of it. So we can't actually store the power we collect. Hmm. It's a bad factory, we should just start over. <laughs> Don't joke, he means it. Don't laugh. He encourages him. Pretty much. Moss being broken now. Really? I like this quick... Iron 5, seriously. This quick upgrade belt thing is nice, but it, it does cause I'm me to make, make a lot of mistakes occasionally where it'll be like... It'll rip up part of the belt and then break connections. Come here, you little blighters. Why are you wrecking our stuff? I just do not understand. I tried, like, adding a pump to one of these steam engine columns and actually made it work slower. I don't even understand. It's okay.
Doesn't make any sense. There we go. Sorted. Damn it, what is being attacked now? Well, just oh, me. wait, Steve. <laughs> Actually, the power does show this sudden boost in... Well, actually, it shows steam... It shows all of steam die. I didn't do that. For some reason, a minute ago, all of steam production just shut down. Pretty sure that wasn't me. Probably because the solar... Solar field is larger than the accumulator field. The accumulators may have gotten charged, shutting down solar. Or shutting down steam. Yeah. And watch the accumulators rapidly drain. Oh, we are improving though. Draining the accumulators, so the accumulators have survived massively longer than they did the previous night. And now they die. But that's like three times as long with like six times as much power. It's a good sign. How's the rocket silo build ring going on? Horrible. Oh. That's not the answer I was hoping for. I updated the solar grid to have four laser turrets in it. Nice. Hmm. We need some productivity modules or speed modules for these. Batteries, that is. We're just producing them so slowly despite the amount that we're making. I do not understand this. The the first, like the steam engine columns are running at 100 degrees, but only up to a certain point. <laughs> and every time I add one, oh man, one pump to it, it drops down to 60 degrees. Bentham, I'm, I'm I'm really trying not to get short with you here, but could you please just make some 11410s and not mess with that? Like you're stuck on it, and there's no. It's very simple. You can only support 10 steam engines per pump. So if you keep trying to do more than that, it's not going to work. Period. There's there's no. All right, all right. It just defies. It it, it does the exact opposite of what I was expecting. I just didn't understand. Yeah, it's the it's the factorial fluid mechanics that like you would assume you'd be able to connect two pumps and you'd have enough water, but it no doesn't work that way. There's a reason why the pump everyone pump produces the pipe's ability to carry the amount of water. Yeah, that's there's a reason why everyone does the the one fourteen ten. Yeah, adding is... a second pump does not add any extra water to the pipe. You've already saturated it, you know, but its ability to move water. So you're you're giving no greater amount of water moving through it. I cannot wait for nuclear. Like, I genuinely can't. Anyone else looking forward to that? Yeah. There's oh, a yeah. there's a mod that is, like, trying to mimic what they've planned, and I'm, I've been I think that's really, to try really cool, honestly. I think that's really cool. Though, so, how are you going to handle it, Arumba, given that it uh, largely uses circuit networks to get the most efficient ones. No. Like, are you still happy with it in, with that being the case, or do you feel that Yeah, I, maybe it should... Oh, you th you're okay with it, you? That's cool. I, I like circuit networks. I just, it's hard, at least for me in this, in this series, to think when I'm trying to do it. Every time I've tried to do circuit stuff recently, I just end up giving up, because it's just... I can't concentrate well enough. Uh, okay. While we're all here and talking. No, that's that's. It's, it's bad enough with Stejo. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> oh, poor Stejo. Where are they coming from? I mean, we're producing so much pollution. I guess they could be coming from anywhere, but still, it's bloody annoying when they do. Hello.
Well, I've been putting some batteries into module, uh, sorry, into some modules into battery production, but it certainly feels like we still don't have enough batteries. The whole column is running. Yeah, yeah that's the thing is we've got so much production over there. It's just that uh, feels so. We're just using it faster than we're producing. <laughs> you know, that, that's ultimately what it comes down to. We're not even close to the production that we're consuming. Ah, cool. You've blueprinted the... Um... What's the word? The modules in there as well, have you? Uh, one of them, yeah. I'm gonna pull one of your other modules out and put it into the others we've got. Just two okay. with full modules, and then paste that around a bit. No, oh, that makes sense, yeah. Trying to maneuver these pipes around is nightmarish. It's just this tiny plot of water. Surrounded entirely with a million pumps. What are you doing? Trying to just hook up some more steam engine columns. Ah. Good. That will definitely help. Well, it's all running. We've got absolutely vast amounts of batteries being produced just by consuming them just as quickly. But it is yeah. good to see that at least the majority of the accumulator column is running. The end is still starved of resources for the most part, but... Where's the accumulators? Uh, just over by the rocket silo. Oh, did you make more? We we are gonna run out of sulfuric acid eventually. We we've had a, a stockpile, yeah. but Yeah, we're now eating into that unfortunately. Well for what it's worth, we have got uh four percent of the way to the rocket. Hooray! <laughs> you there in no time. Oh god, biters. Damn it. Sitting with a steam engine and a biter attacked it, and then it got set on fire by the defenses. <laughs> that sounds hilarious. I approve. Okay, oh, yeah. battery production is yeah, actually yeah. a lot better now. And suddenly there's no power. I was going to say, why does my alert say that we don't need any... Yeah, that's better. <laughs> any accumulators. Plastic is dribbling into the red circuit area at the moment. Dribbling like, uh, like a soccer player. <laughs> um, no, no, I was... Well, I mean, they're... Sort of dribbling. They're not normally the most intelligent people, but I wouldn't say they were dribbling. <laughs> One of the problems that we're facing is that due to the low power, the inserters are having a hard time picking up the plastic as it's moving past. It's only at daytime that our production ever really picks up properly. Unless the belt is saturated. At which point it's fine. Well, you work, uh, I'm going to come down and uh, check on Bentham's steam engine setup. I'm just shoehorning in. I'm so far one new column. And all that time? It, it, there's a lot of... Column? There's a lot of pipe issues shenanigans go. 
Shenanigans, I call. I think he's just been sitting playing Game Boy. I think he's been spending time with girls. What? Can never trust that Bantham. He acts all innocent. We all know he's secretly a Casanova. He's gonna be thinking about biters again. <laughs> <laughs> that was where I was heading with it, yeah. Yeah, that, you, well done. You... you <laughs> caught yeah. on. Casanova with, quickly. <laughs> with biters. Okay, I've now made a grand total of one steam engine column. Hooray! Now, we will I'm... blueprint it and just make lots of them. There we go, I see the tiny little hop in, in power there that I made. I did oh, that. Of you. Yep. I think it's blueprinting it isn't enough because I've got to work out more pipe nightmarishness here. Actually, there's Fine. some water down here I can I can get I trust you. from. I think what I could do is I could do like a, a line of landfill down the middle and then I could put more pumps in. Very well. But then I would need multiple pipes coming out for the throughput to work. Oh, dread. It appears that I don't ah, have on me any robot ports. Oh, scallywags. I am. Um, hmm. I'm just going to leave that up to you. Is there a problem in the blueprint that I didn't notice before I made it? No, no, I was I was going to take a blueprint and start making some, but I'll just leave it up to you guys. Okay. Because I must confess, my, my ability to notice problems with these sort of things is, is small at, at the best of times, but it, it's virtually not there at the moment. Do we have any landfill getting made automatically? Uh, no, I do not believe so. Right. We probably got the stone for that. Yeah, I think we might. More robot ports be delivered, damn it. Don't make me make my own. Right now, just to make a million pipes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, alternatively, you could go and just collect the pipes from elsewhere. Well, I meant, I meant make mostly in the terms of build them on the ground. Okay. Which in this particular case is in. awkward and messy. I have some steel of my own. Make some robots. Okay, let's see, I thought steel was going to be the problem, but... It Really not. It's really more uh, red circuits, green circuits, red circuits, into blue. Yeah. We can't seem to make the. What are they? There's a. I think it takes processing units and speed module ones, and like red circuits, whatever that item is that rockets use. Also, we I I did not actually set up anything to automate the production of a satellite. Just rockets. Ooh. If you want to launch a rocket with a satellite, then that has yet to be done. Now, launching rockets with satellites is a necessary part of winning the game. And I prefer launching them with fish. Are you sending them off to the dolphins? Yeah, they need supplies. That's true. They were pretty, pretty dapper about the whole trying to warn us thing. I mean, that's being too dumb to understand aside. It was genuinely quite nice of them. It's only fair that we repay them. I mean, it was almost enough to make us forgive them about the rape cave stuff, but... No. Lest we forget. We must never forget. Dolphins are evil. And they do enjoy rape. Oh, uh, God. Well, anyway... 
Thank you, Bentham. <laughs> Just that is that time, yes. Yeah, we we we've, we've reached twenty minutes. Just regardless, please Let's... send help. I feel that like we can't end on this point. We need another point. Oh, we're fixing power. That's what we're doing. Let me check the the power menu thing. With a bare minimum of dragging people off to caves with our prehensile penises. Bare minimum. I mean, I can't speak for Mangle Pork. Like I said, he's I'm trying. He's a bit of a dodgy. I'm trying to one salvage one, this but... here. I'm trying. You're making it difficult. Definitely trying. Next oh, episode, we'll, we'll we'll fix power more than we we already have done. We'll get Hooray. more boilers in, and then it'll work, and then we'll have power, and then we can make rockets, and all be good in the world. So with that, we should say goodbye. Thank you for watching, and we shall see you next time. So long, and thanks for all the fish. See you soon.